what is in that bag? Oh. <laughs> there was books inside of here. Oh my gosh, that's why it hurt. What is up YouTube? This is Jolo2TV back again with another video and yet another haul slash unboxing video. Now what do we have today? Today we have Rue 21 and a little bit of Goodwill. Now again, we are in Atlanta, Georgia and we got a new area to shop at. Oh God, that's a lot of energy. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna crack right into the Goodwill stuff. I only got a little bit of things, but definitely worth it. All right, so the first thing that I picked up from Goodwill is the Walking Dead t-shirt. It has the Walking Dead on the front of it. On the back, keep calm and call Daryl. Now, what are the odds of me finding this shirt in Atlanta? Anyways, let's get cracking on the next thing. The next shirt that I found at Goodwill was a pretty nice shirt. This shirt looks brand new. Um, I have no clue about this brand. It's called Permanent Vacation. A deep fried family established in 2010. Anyways, I like this shirt because it was like one of those 3M reflective things. So when you put a, a flash on it, um, it turns into white. But you can see it says established with all those flags and then 2010. And then this is a mirrored version of it on the back. And on the sleeves, it's like little flags all the way down. I love this shirt. And this, along with the other shirt, was like five or four dollars each. We snapped up a pretty good deal at Goodwill. But that's it for the Goodwill. Now on to Rue 21. This is where we went a little crazy, but I got a good deal. Keep in mind that it is Black Friday right now and we went shopping earlier this morning for some Black Friday deals at Rue 21. It was like 40% off your entire purchase and the dad hats were $5 each. So I had a blast. This is one of the dad hats I got, um, the Martian. So let's start off with the dad hats. First off, we got a Reptar dad hat which is from Rugrats. I remember watching this show, it just brought back a lot of good memories. But this hat is some good stuff right here. Next up, for the 20th year anniversary of Space Jam's Rue 21, had a lot of Looney Tunes characters. The next one I picked up was the Bugs Bunny hat. It's all white with that one Bugs Bunny face. I thought this one was pretty simple, but yet still fashionable. So I went ahead and picked this one up again for five dollars this one is the funniest and I just I don't know I just wanted to get it and if you know what it is it resembles you know who right there is like I believe this is like a, a very light pink or off-white it is a Kim Kardashian selfie shout out to Kim Kardashian but this is who this is supposed to be the skin tone looks a little bit darker than what Kim is, but uh, we will take it. Another $5 dad hat. And then a shirt that I picked up from Room 21 was this one. It was like $10. This was like a ripped hole kind of thing. They were trying to do like a Kanye kind of vibe and uh, I went for it. I was like, I gotta support my fake Kanye, man. This has a nice little hood up at the top. This hood is for like Florida when it's hot outside all day. And then next moment, nice and cool. Next up, the reason why I bought this jacket was because I am in the ATL and I decided why not. It says, I got broads in Atlanta just like the I feel like Pablo merchandise that he was selling earlier this year <laughs> i just <laughs> again this is just an exact replica of what the kanye west i feel like pablo jackets look like um it says i got broads and atl uh, <laughs> This one was probably one of my favorite pickups. I got it just because of the I feel like Pablo vibes, but I like this. All right, and last but not least, we got the designer shirt from Rue 21. Of course, we have the designer face on one half and a panda 
on the other side. But I saw this shirt and I was like, dang, I swear I saw this on his website. And I believe this is where they also got it from was his shop online. It says designer inside of there. So I think this is some authentic wear. I'm not too sure, double check me on that. If not, I'm still gonna wear it anyways. But yeah, guys, that's what I picked up this week. I got a nice haul for you guys, the most I've ever done before. I just went shopping, I saw some stuff over here in Atlanta, and I had to go for it. A lot of style over here, a lot of swagger, and a lot of heat. But thank you for watching the video, please like, subscribe, and comment on the video, and please be sure to share. Jolo2TV, out.